Now let's have a look at the oxygen data from his Sleep HQ O2 ring. So here we are on Sleep HQ. This is my cloud-based sleep apnea management platform. Checking out Chris's Sleep HQ O2 ring data. We get the blood oxygen levels, the pulse rate, and also movement data. They should be nice and steady up at 96, 97, but look where they are. They're down here at 70, way too low. Look at his pulse rate, bumping around up here at 100, 104. And then look at all the movement data here. And if we come up to the statistics up here, drops over 4%, 255 times a night. Now let's take a look at how the results changed with the first night of CPAP therapy. You ready? Here we go. All right, have a look at the blood on levels. Nice and stable.